2019 AD. Two men. Two bikes. One ultimate challenge. Climb aboard your iron steed. Both contenders, O and O. Are both hungry for glory. The goal is simple. Be the first to cross the finish line. They answered the question nobody asked. Supermoto or Enduro. Hold on, hold on. I should uh, probably mention neither of us has a clue about what we're doing. Roll the tape. Spinny, spinny. You ready for this? <laughs> you all ready for this? Okay. Yeah. Oh, the, we've got birds circling us. Is that a good sign? Well, they've just gone, they're in the field. So you can start on your gravelly road bit. You're going to go up there and turn left onto the road. I'm following this as the crow flies all the way to the meeting point. For me, which is 7.8 miles away, and for Sean, it's 10 miles away if he goes that way. i got to sort of go back before I, to hit the road before we go forward. Yeah. Sean's got to stick to the speed limits. Yeah. So I've got a short <coughs> drive, but yeah. Sean's got a higher average speed and traffic to contend with, so let's see who makes it to the finish first. Here we go. It's going to be a classic 3-2-1 start. Are you ready? That's it. Oh God. Oh, it's really slippy, it's really greasy down here today. And they're off. Oh, I think this is all wet now. It's an ideal day for some green laning and cars, I believe. We'll be good, we'll be good. So I've got to go backwards to get onto this main road here. And that's when I can start hopefully catching him up. Never tried to do this really that quick. We normally stop at every road and have a chat. Have a bit of a plan where we're going, but today, none of that. It's just go, go, go. Hopefully I can make it as well, without breaking down. That would be annoying. Right, we've got one small road section here. Yeah, the rain is a bit annoying. What do you do though? Well there, that's it, 60. This is going to be the boring bit. And it's raining as well. Brilliant. I don't think it'll slow Jamie down. The uh, rain. God, I hope I win. But because of the rain we've had over the last few days, it's going to be quite slow as well. Got a little wave off him. I feel so good to be back on the Enduro as well. These tyres are phenomenal. On the last video we came down here on these, we're on the Supermoto setup, so I don't know if you've seen it, but we'll link it at the end of this video if not, so anyone can have a look. But yeah, the t for the tyres on them. And we're driving into the only cloud in the sky, which is that big black one. Right, we're back off-road again. 
no speed limit other than my own bottle it should have gone on the grass I think there was maybe already enough heat in the road because of the sun this morning that the rain kind of just evaporated because my tyre doesn't look to be wet at all which is good so Jay, that's one of the roads Jamie just had to cross that one looks way smoother we're all about speed today and it really is raining now as well rain's prickly oh we've got some good speed up here but it's going to start getting a bit oh, a bit rough again come on oh wow, that's slippy Oh, nice feeling when you start going sideways. Jamie also has to cross this road here. Nice hard work this is. It feels like when you do a bit of enduring and a bit of off-roading, over the hours or whatever where you stood up quite a lot and using your arms a lot to uh, stabilize yourself and your legs i feel like i've just accelerated the whole process so in the space of like five minutes now my legs are like getting a bit of a burn so yeah he's over there somewhere i keep expecting sean to come down the wrong road and go past here somewhere i would say at this point here we might be further ahead however when we get to the end of this road, the main road we join is quite long to get to the finish point. It's probably the most challenging section I've got now. I'm going to have to go a bit slower through here. Oh, right, okay. Oh, oh my god. Oh, it's nearly got wiped out. Now I've just noticed there's a much smoother line over here. I can get in it through the trees. Just smoothing it out a bit. Don't be fooled, it gets bumpy again. It's probably going to be struggling and, and it's probably going to crash. Whoa, yep. Almost getting a bit of air off that. I think Jamie's been dying to get uh, have another go on his enduro saddle. I wonder whether one of these roads do cross over my line. Sean's going on. I need to order a new chain and then I can go to the enduro setup again have a few more blasts on that. You know what, we're coming up to the main road now, I think. I reckon we might be in by quite a long way. <laughs> okay, which one's good here? Oh, not many. Big, big time bumps. A17, yeah, we're here. Let's get back in here. So Jamie's gone as the crow flies, and I've gone, I've had to make quite a few turns and switches. These are them quiet sections I was talking about. I use too much brain power. Right, I'm going after the van. Careful around 
Yeah, it could be fine. It's one of those when you go a different way to someone, you ain't, because you're moving, you see that they probably aren't making any progress, but he probably thinks the same. in there, I'm going in that one. Is he hiding in a bush? Oh my, so rocky, so unstable. Oh, I've only gone and beat him. No way! Oh, there he is! There he is! Please don't be Sean. And he's got to wash my bike. Although it's pretty clean. Oh, it is! He is not going to be happy. I've been here 20 minutes. You've only been recording 17. Oh yeah. That's close. I've just come round the corner and saw you. Oh my god, I'm knackered. Could you have gone any quicker? <sighs> yeah. Really? But I was at the point where like obviously you don't you can only see so far ahead and the faster you go in, the less chance you've got to avoid things. Yeah. I'm trying to pick the smoothest route all the time. I can't even breathe. I am knackered. <laughs> I was going so fast. The quickest you've ever gone. And I lost it. By just. I can't believe it. When I saw your headlight come over that thing, I was like, <laughs> I was thinking, right, I'm going to hide. I've beat him here. And then no. Well, that answers that question. Good effort, though. Less knackering and faster. Which obviously anyone with a brain yeah. could work out. <laughs> but was it as much fun? No, it's pretty boring. I had a lot of fun. I had three corners. Did you? Yeah, and then I had um, had a junction there. That that was pretty gnarly. Yeah, just the junction. Well, and that's it. <sighs> Hope you like the introduction to the video. Oh yeah. Put some effort in there, didn't yeah. we? Big time. Next video. Oh, we're filming it tomorrow. Yeah, next video. Another Grom content alert. We're trying to keep it even, Stephen. Ish. Okay, let's have a nice smooth ride back. So hopefully you enjoyed that. We're trying to keep the content as uh, kind of random and interesting as we can. Uh, make sure if you like the video, you give us a like. If you want to help the channel out, give us a share. If you want to see more hit that subscribe and a little bell but you all know that anyway see you Jamie I'm going straight on